The truth is that there is no guarantee that money will make you happy because Adam wa nefesh vedamim it's money. Money contain spirits inside of it. So when you receive money, you receive spirits with it. And if the money that is coming holds spirits, means souls, particles of nefesh, of souls that are not in your level that you won't be able to deal with, they can be nervous, they can be sad, they can have desires, they can be made out of fire, they can speed up, they can do many, many things. It depends in those particles of spirit that will come with the money. And you don't know what you're going to receive in that huge suitcases that you dream on. It can contain something spiritually, spiritual cargo that you won't have the ability to deal with. And Hashem Ibrah, He knows that. And this is why He is holding back those redemptions, those salvations that we are so desired to receive because He knows what is better for us. That it's better for you to build more vessels, to receive more tools, that when one day you will open that suitcase, you will have the ability to deal with that. And with those hours in the Beit Midrash, and with that house, and with that fancy car, and with that wife, and with those children, and whatever, with Aliyah. It's just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator. To remember that it's all Him, never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those husks.